This is our second annual Art Slam exhibit. The Art Center actually had the Art Slam back in April and the winner of the Art Slam gets to have a solo exhibit here at the library. I feel like I've always been an artist. Maybe not a practicing artist, but an artist at heart. I decided this is what I wanted to pursue. I was teaching and I said, well, how do I go about doing this? Pursuing your art outside of teaching was something I really wasn't familiar with, so I did a lot of research. Last year was our first year that we started a competition called Art Slam. And Art Slam, is a two-hour event where artists are given a supply of items and they have to create art only using the items that we supply them with a two-hour time frame. And we spoke with the library about partnering to do an exhibit for the person that won to host it at the library. It is absolutely so much fun when you get there and you have this box of stuff and you start creating and then you make, 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 make and the two hours is gone very, very quickly. Um, I think is one of the highlights of my year at the Art Center. The feedback we get from them is that they find it really interesting and challenging that they have to step out of their wheelhouse a little bit. If they're only painters or if they're only collage type artists, then we're asking them to incorporate different things that they wouldn't normally do. I can paint photorealistic, but to me, the challenge is not really there because you're painting something that already exists, you're kind of copying something. I like very textural things, which shows up in my assemblage pieces. So I started working with paints and layers and mark making, using anything I could find. People come to the library that may not have been to the Art Center, so we're engaging new people in art. Also, it's yet another community place that if they maybe are looking at art at the Art Center but they haven't been to the library lately, then maybe that would draw them into the library. So it's a really great partnership for us to be able to bring the art out into the community in a different way. It's more to me about the process than the end product, and I think that's where my joy and my success has come from. I don't really worry about the end product, and I don't worry about sales. I don't worry about anything like that. I just enjoy what I'm doing.